Would you want to take a COVID-19 test at home? Well, the FDA has granted emergency authorization to these at-home COVID-19 tests. One of the three things to know this afternoon. These kits are supplied by a company called Everly Well. They're available by a prescription, so you still have to check in with a doctor. The sample collection kit, kit comes with a nasal swab. It's mailed back to an authorized lab. They run the test and then get you your results. I Promising news for the airline industry this weekend was the busiest for air travel since March. According to the TSA, more than 250,000 passengers were screened on Sunday at airports nationwide. In total, nearly 450,000 people passed through TSA checkpoints on Saturday and Sunday combined, which is about 62,000 more last weekend. J Bell, what's up with Uber safety? Yes, yeah, some changes are on the way to how we use the company. Starting today, they are requiring drivers and passengers to wear face masks. Now, before drivers can accept trips, they have to take a photo of themselves with the mask on. Riders and drivers will also have to verify that they have taken certain steps to help stop the spread of the coronavirus. Uber is also advising riders to no longer sit in that front seat.